Hi guys, welcome back to tutorial page. In this video tutorial, we will be working on front section of our e-commerce project. We have already added here list of categories. This, this is the list of the categories which I have already added here. And uh, these are the list of the products which I have also added. P of the projects are featured products. So in the front end, front end section, uh, I will show in this section the feature products. Okay, so let's go to our project section. So this is the front end. Okay. Now let's open this index to HP and find one of the products. Let's find one of the products. So better let's inspect it for after feature items. Find so it must be so okay. So here is featured item. So that means uh, single product, and then this is one product. Okay, so what I will do, I will keep one of the products structure and remove the rest. So, add to this list and to compare that means one product is product that part, this one. So, let's check from here. Water, one, solid. Yes, this is one of the section. So it starts from or is a code from here to there. And then let's delete the rest of the sections. to here now let's check how many products are visible so there are currently still four more products that means we need to delete up to here perhaps let's see yes yeah, so now Yes, so we have just kept only one. Yeah. So let's check it if it worked properly or not. So click on this and it's ending here. So 
and this is the ending of featured items. Yes, this one. This is my study idea here. I need to remove this. Yeah, fine now. Now we will write home here. Home the shelf. HP. But before that, let's make a connection in the top here. So I right here. DB connect of PHP and this DB connect is inside admin. So I will have to write here admin. That that this file is inside admin folder. That is why. So well, let's save select star from. Products where feature equal to yes, very to my SPLI very dollar on. Dollar cell. Now, while dollar rules equal to buy spell I catch catch. Array. You are right. And then the while loop will be closed there. So let's check how I did. Yes, so we have uh, four feature products that is why it is displayed four times. If you want to make it more, then just go to edit and then make it as feature yes and then update. Now check here, so it should come five times. So it's working correctly now again. I want to display this one also. Feature equal to yes. So, so in total here, six item as feature. Now let's show the original data. There will be the price. PHP.
Okay, so these are the original price coming. Now, here will be the product name. HP equal Now, this will show the name of the product. As you can see, now it is showing the name of different product. An image. So, it is inside images. Then, here will be the name of the image so I write here road image check yes the product image is coming correctly but we will have to set fixed size for the product because of different size of the product, the design is here and there. So let's check the original size. Right here, something. Okay, so I think we have to increase some height. Two hundred and fifty width is okay. So this is the product list from our admin section what we had added. Here will be product description. This is name, product name, product name, and here will be product price. Price. Yes. You see, this is showing like t shirt and price, and then it to cart. Add to cart. So now, if I click on Add to Cart, then it should go to Product Details page. So let's do one thing. Add to Cart here. We have some file. T dogs.
proud of what it is. Just open it and save it as lot of details in the HP. So again, here, top header. Let's remove this. Right here, PHP acquired acquired once Require once header dot php. Okay, we will make further changes in this, but for the time timing, that's fine. Now, if I click on to cart, it should go to Details of HP. Details dot HP. Details dot PHP. And then question mark. Road ID equal to PHP equal. Dollar rules pro underscore ID. Same thing with right here also. and click on any of the products. Now we are coming to this product details page. This is our product details page with product ID. So after clicking it is going to product details page we will fill, we will fetch the details of that individual problem, but I will do show you that in the next video for the time being. Let's keep it as it is. So see you in the next video. Stay connected. Thanks for watching.